Regular. SEC play is upon us as tomorrow at this time the Mizzou men's basketball team will be kicking off conference play in front of the second straight sold out crowd at Mizzou Arena. As the Tigers get set to host number 19 Kentucky, they're coming off of two big road wins against UCF in Illinois. Head coach Dennis Gates said today that in the offseason, you look at your schedule in three different parts, non-conference, conference, and postseason. Gates said that he's seen his team grow through the non-conference schedule, but now's the time to take it up a notch to ensure that they get to that third part of the season. The team also is relying on a few returners that have played these teams in the past. In that last part of your season, most, a lot of teams do not come away with three parts, and uh, some do if you add the conference tournament. But, you know, it's, it's pretty much one of those things that you have to um, – continue to evolve. I tell our guys all the time, you know, playing in the SEC, it's, it's not easy. Like all the games we play, it's going to be like a like a war, really. It's not easy to get a win. You got to earn every win you get, uh, no matter if it's by one point or 30 points. Uh, it's, it's hard. Speaking of Kobe Brown today, he was named the SEC's player of the week for his big time performance in the Bragg and Rights game. Brown put up a career best 31 points against Illinois, not to mention eight assists, five rebounds, and four steals. Brown also was named the Lute Olsen National Player of the Week yesterday.